Johnston with a bit of right arm off spin. And as Villani very quickly onto the back foot gets her innings underway. It'll bring Annabelle Sutherland on to strike. So apologies. I don't, I don't know where I was going with the Meg Lanning piece, but the ball also skidding on slightly. As with the traditional sweep to Elise Villani and finds the boundary in the first over. Confidently onto the front foot is Elise Villani and caresses it through the offside. That's the way to finish off. Yeah, that's nice yeah. again. Confidence from Villani to... Slaps it through the offside, finds the gap. She is off and going, Elise Villani. And then goes, boom, up and over the top. So a defence followed by the boundary for Villani. It's a loose delivery from Strano, and Kerry can't get a hand on it. And Amy Swift... Oh, and is through up. The pressure was building, and Valemic with the extra pace is through Sutherland. Luck. Chopped on. Meg Lanning's form in terms of not getting past the start continues. She's only got three to her name. Chopped on again. It's almost a carbon copy of Meg Lanning. And Vlamenic is on fire at Utah Stadium. Short ball. Boucher goes after it. Does she get enough of it? She certainly does. It's drilled down oh. the ground and past Midoff, who is up inside the circle. So some... Molly Strano is back into the attack. And Kim Garth says thank you very much. Of oh. Different pitch, different conditions, different opposition. And just over the top. Full toss and dispatched through the offside. You can control. Bouchier loves to get across the crease and give herself some room to hit through the onside. Oh, a little ramp, yeah, I've got enough on it. That will race away as well. Does she clear? Yes, she does. She clears Gosh and she clears the mid on boundary. So Garth goes to the offside and does it very nicely indeed. A boundary off the first. Been Bouchier and Garth. Straight down the ground. She's hit a six in that direction already, but this one is out. Doesn't have enough power on it. Valemic has picked up three, and now wicket to boot. Across her crease, finds the gap in the air and over the boundary. That is the way to finish off the innings. She moves to 44 from 29. A wonderful partnership. Oh, Boulder, what a peach of a delivery from Garth. Take it away, Mornay Morkel. <laughs> that is the best <laughs> ball I've seen. On the charge, Rachel Priest, yeah, gets onto the front foot nicely. No one will chase that down. Get some more width, and that's through. Nicely timed once again from Rachel Priest for back to back boundary. Looks to go big, Rachel Priest to the offside and does it nicely. Hit firmly through the offside. On the front foot this time, up and over goes Rachel Priest, starting to get a little bit of a move on. Priest, it's gone straight up in the air, looking to go for the maximum, and it's a court and bold to Sophie Day. Yeah, a sigh of relief too, because it was hanging up there for quite some time. Again goes Ariel, does Dupria enough on it. Oh, that struck nicely as well. That should be back-to-back -back boundaries. It is. Leg stump is the guard. Exposes all three stumps. Lindsay Smith thought she might have almost had Minon Dupri a bit instead. Full oh, toss God. straight down the ground. Almost Sophie Devine-like. Oh, it oh. sounded good off the bat. Yes, 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 <laughs> Minon Dupri. Basically a slot. Is it through? It is. Yeah, valuable runs here for the Hobart Hurricanes. Straight back. Does she get oh. a little hand on it? Sutherland, oh. she does. Oh. And it means that Nicola Carey, all she can do... ...follows a little bit of pad, I think, and that gets past Fulton into the boundary. 
Struck nicely and it's through. That will be a boundary. Oh, she doesn't get all of it this time, though, and she's out. A boundary, the ball before Sutherland fights back and gets the key wicket of Mignon Dupria. Thick outside edge. That goes up and over. Just worked around That's the cool. corner. That's gone really fine, and she's found the, ball, <laughs> the boundary. Keeper up, strikes it nicely, up and over the top. Boy, that's nice. She's playing a little gem here, Richard Gosh. She goes to 17 from 11. Two needed. Richard Gosh goes back. She goes boom. She gets it with the four, and that is a magnificent run chase by the Hobart Hurricanes. They've finished off their run in Hobart, in Tasmania for that matter, with a win. And it smiles all around for the players in purple.